Is it hemp or marijuana? That's the big question these days for police in Tennessee. One plant, of course, is legal. The other is not. And as News Channel 5's Nick Barris tells us, the difficulty telling the difference between the two is a problem for law enforcement. Here's the thing. Law enforcement comes upon a plant like this in someone's yard. And I'll tell you what, it smells like it. It looks like marijuana. How can you tell? whether it's marijuana or hemp. You can't look at this and tell the chemical composition of it, right? But hemp specialist Clint Palmer says there is a very big difference between the two plants. Hemp is legal in Tennessee. Marijuana, which contains much higher amounts of the psychoactive agent THC, is not. But here's the rub. Several drug agents who asked not to be identified tell News Channel 5 since they can't tell the difference in the plants, it's difficult to enforce the law. I think probably the biggest problem is, you know, just education. Whether it's plant or product. Remember the bust earlier this year of stores selling CBD gummies in Rutherford County? It turns out the gummies were made from hemp, not marijuana. This one's a female. Palmer cultivates hemp to provide legal seeds to the increasing number of Tennessee citizens, now nearly 300, who seek licenses to grow the plant. Sheriffs across the state are supposed to be alerted to crops in their county, but there was recently a near raid in East Tennessee. The eradication force was at a property and they just called the local sheriff and he basically said, oops, my bad, and they flew on. Drug agents also worry that dealers may start growing marijuana hidden in a hemp field. But Palmer says state inspectors who visit each crop will find the marijuana. He hopes no one tries it. That's the last thing I want for the hemp industry is more bad news. The bottom line in the coming years, more and more farmers in Tennessee are going to be growing this crop. It's not marijuana, it's hemp. And learning how to tell the difference is going to be dependent on everyone educating themselves on the process. Nick Barris, News Channel 5. Many are viewing the hemp industry as a potential replacement in Tennessee for farmers who no longer have as large a demand for tobacco.